Hi everyone, I'm Manvi and we are going to paint these lemons today with watercolors. I'm using Bahang Artists watercolor paper and Princeton Aqua Elite uh, round brush. And I'm using colors of uh, different brands as uh, written on the screen. After wetting the paper, I'm using a cool yellow, uh, Aurelian. I added a little bit of yellow ochre to it. As Mijalo uh, yellow ochre is too bright, I am using a Sanelia yellow ochre now. I am using Sab Green from White Nights. Just a little near the edges. And then I am going to blend it out. I'm mixing Aurelian with uh, Dioxin Violet for the shadows. There wasn't enough space on the spiral so it's not visible here. As yellow and violet are opposite in a color wheel, they neutralize each other. Now I'm adding another layer of Aurelian. And with a clean brush, I'm lifting up the color for the highlight. Adding more shadows here at the bottom and some little details. Now I'm using raw sienna for some details. Uh, some little dots and some details here and there. Now moving on to another lemon, I am painting with clear water and adding that same yellow uh, for the wet and wet technique. Now I am using the mixture of Aurelian and yellow ochre by Mijello. Painting with just yellow now leaving some space for the highlight. Adding more color on the top of the lemon by using raw sienna and some yellow ochre by Senelia. This is uh, again that cool yellow that I am using all over the lemon. Lifting some color using my clean brush. Adding some more color on the top. Using some sap green now near the edges and at the bottom. And now for the shadows, I'm using that same mixture that I used earlier for the lemon. Uh, this is dioxin violet and and some aureolian. Now the lemons are complete and let's move on to painting some leaves and stem. Using some sap green mixed with green by white nights. And at the bottom part I am using that cool yellow. Now 
Now I am painting the leaves by using sap green mixed with some yellow. This green by White Nights is a bit darker than the sap green. I left some space in the middle for the vein. And now I am using a chisel blender to lift mm -hmm. off the color. I use this brush as an eradicator brush. To fix some mistakes and uh, lifting off some color. You can also use your uh, round brush but make sure it's clean and slightly wet. Now I'm painting some veins on the lower side of the leaf. Now moving on to the next leaf, I am painting with clean water first and then I am using some sap green mixed with yellow. Now adding some green to the leaf. and leaving some spaces in the middle for the veins. Again using my chisel blender brush to lift off some color. Using some green to increase the depth of the leaf. Adding some ultramarine too for the darker parts. This is sap green mixed with some yellow uh, for the lower part of the leaf. Adding some shadows and veins uh, with green. Now painting with clear water on the third leaf. Some yellow uh, wash to it and some sap green at the lower part. Again painting with some green and leaving some spaces for veins. And lifting off some color uh, wherever needed. This leaf is too light right now so I am adding more green to it.
adding some green to the stem make it a little bit darker and now I'm using ultramarine mixed with green for the leaf to increase its depth now painting this leaf which is mostly hidden by this lemon initial layers I am using sap green mixed with yellow painting with some green at the lower part of the leaf Now I am going to paint this uh, last leaf. Again I am using that same mixture of sap green and cool yellow for the first layer. Repeating the same process using green. Now I'm just adding some final touches to the lemons. Now this painting is complete and I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you did please like this video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already.